Okay, Romanio, so remember we did a video about a year and a half ago? <laughs> Where we talked about some of the elements? Yeah, absolutely. And you did a great job. Unatium. Unatium, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, but today we're going to advance on that video and we're going to talk about some of the other things that we've been studying. Uh, first of all, we're going to move this, of course, our Nerf basketball and put that over there. Um, one of the things that we're going to talk about really quick is your scaffolding or the tree, the knowledge base that we've been building on. Okay. First we had uh, one of the things that you've been talking about lately, Dad, I teach me supersymmetry, right? Supersymmetry. But before I could teach you supersymmetry, I had to teach you what? Standard model. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, anyway. But before I could teach you the standard model, I had to teach you something called classical physics. Classical physics. We'll just do it like that, right? I'm running out of space. Uh, but think of it think of it this way before you can get to supersymmetry where we have some exotic names of exotic particles uh, we know uh, we have the we know right okay um, but before you can get to the we know in the standard model we're dealing with up quark well, down quark okay up kind of quark down quark Electron. Well, that's over here. An electron is a class of a particle called a lepton. Okay, uh, so we have, look, okay, so if we're going to deal with quarks, I'm going to write a big Q here. So quarks, we have the up quark, we have the down quark, that's down, we have the strange, the charm, actually it's a charm strange, we have the top, and we have this one which is the bottom. Okay, and over here we have a class of uh, of particles called electrons. In electrons, we have the electron, then we have the. What's that? Like a, a big hydrogen. Oh, yes, 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 yes. A it does. Okay, it look, does look like a big H, a big hydrogen. We have the electron, then we have the. What's this? We just see the big V. What's that? I'll try to do this. I have not done this yet. It's probably the wrong time. That's the muon, and then that's the muon neutrino. All right. So then we have the the tau and the tau neutrino. Tau neutrino. Okay. And then we have something called the force particles. Okay. Force particles. Force particles. What is light? What is light? What is light made of? What is, okay, what is, that? Okay, what is light made of? Okay. Uh, then the other force particle that holds the nucleus together, that holds... Gluon! Gluon, okay. Okay. And then, now we're getting to the aspect of supersymmetry, which we were talking about earlier. We have what's responsible for the weak forces, the W and the, what's that? Z. The Z what? Z boson. Okay, all right. So. It's anti-particle nothing. Yeah, it has no anti-particle, that's right. It has, you know, you can know for anti-particles. Uh, what is the anti- um, and this, and it's, uh, supposedly that one had an antiparticle. Okay, what's the antiparticle of the W? W. Oh, it's called a W. Okay, good. Uh, I never thought it was just W. Yeah, well, it's interesting that they would just call it the W. Uh, okay, what is the antiparticle of the photon? And, no. No, okay. <laughs> what about the gluon? What's the antiparticle of the gluon? No. All right, no. All right. That's nice. That's nice. You never said that before. Um, okay, so we have all of the, uh, well, wait a minute, two more. Okay? Now, once we combine these U's, 
if we do up, up, down, we make a what? If we make a down, down, up, we make a what? Neutron. Make a neutron. Okay. All right. We make a neutron. All right. But here's what you here's 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 something that you probably don't even remember is when we were we were you know when we went over classical physics is when we were at the Deer Great Park and we would see things like now we just talked about an e over here. And, and uh, the standard model, or in particle physics, but in classical physics, this E is what? Energy. Yeah, so it's just like uh, Einstein's so, uh, E equals MC. Square. All right, and what does the C stand for? Um, light. Very good, light. And so you could then draw a straight arrow from there then you could draw an arrow from here to here, okay? But also, wait a minute, we have the Z boson, but in supersymmetry we have what are called what? What, what, what is the Z boson in supersymmetry? Zeno. Zeno, yeah. Yeah. And <laughs> where are you going? Give me a kiss, man. Ah! Rest of it. Rest of what? Rest of Zeno. But what about uh, the quarks in supersymmetry? Quarks. Oh, all right. So that's going to be over here. And what about, oh, what are the leptons called when we're dealing with supersymmetry? Leptons. <laughs> leptons, yeah, that's interesting, right? Yes.